Hi everyone! Today I wanted to do a quick Valentine's Day inspired makeup look for you. If you want to see the full look, please stay tuned and we'll get started. So I already went ahead and moisturized, put my foundation on, concealer, primer, and I've set my primer. Also put my eyebrows on. Yes, put my eyebrows on. So next we're going to go ahead and start with the eyeshadow. First, I'm going to go ahead and go in with one of my favorite eyeshadows. It is the Makeup Geek Duo Chrome Eyeshadow. It is just a singular pan, but this is such a pretty color. It kind of matches my nails. Anyways, it's called Black Light. So I'm just going to go ahead and cover my lid with that. For the rest of this look, I'm going to go in with my Color Workshop eyeshadow palette. It has a hundred colors and despite it being just a Walmart palette, they are extremely pigmented and I really enjoy working with them. <sighs> so for this look, I'm going to focus on these colors here and maybe some of these reds in there. Um, I might put a little bit of purple under the eye but I'm not entirely sure yet. So first I'm gonna go in with this rose gold color here and I'm just gonna focus that right in my crease. go ahead with a clean brush and just buff it all out and blend it all out. In color pair, I find that just reds now don't really look good as an eyeshadow, so I'm going to play out more of a pink look today for Valentine's Day. I'm going to go ahead with this really pretty pink here. I know it's got a little bit of a... Ooh. <sighs> Alright, well that is not... It's not even pink! <laughs> Anyways, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and try this purple, purpley pink here. And I'm just gonna focus that right on the outer corner of my eyes. I'm going to go in with my cleaner brush and just buff out the edges. Okay, so now that my eyes are a pretty like light pink to dark pink, I think I might add just a little bit of purple along the bottom waterline and I might add a little bit of glitter to the lid. I'm going to go ahead with one of these little pointy brushes and I'm going to... trying to break my door down. I'm going to use this purple down here and I'm just going to line my bottom waterline because I'm not wearing a black liner today to make this look really heavy. It's going to be more of a pretty light look. So I'm going to use a light purple to just line my waterline. So this is the base look that I'm going to go with and now I'm just going to go in and kind of embellish it a little bit. So first I'm going to go back in with a little bit of my concealer and just put a little bit of a base um, on my eyelid for the color to stick to. Next I'm going to go in with my Morphe 12Z palette. It is the Zodiac Smoky Eye Palette. And I'm going to go in once again with this beautiful 
silvery glitter color here. And I'm just going to pat it where I put the concealer. I'm just focusing on the inner corners of my eyes right now. Back with the clean brush to just buff it out. Last but not least for the eyeshadow color, I just, I really am in love with this color right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and darken up the outer corners of my eyes with that color. I like that much more. So for lips today, I'm going to go ahead with my favorite lipstick. This is my holy grail lipstick. It is the Milani Matte Lipstick. It is called Matte Love number 73 and it is just like a beautiful dark burgundy red color. And it's not too dark, it's not too red where I can't pull it off, and it's not too dark where it's like overwhelming, it's just the right amount of color. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on, and then I'm going to fix my hair, put on an outfit, and that'll be my Valentine's Day look. Alright, this is my completed Valentine's Day inspired look. I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. This is my first tutorial ever, pretty much like a talking tutorial. So I hope that you guys enjoyed it, and if you'd like to see more, like I said before, please leave a comment down below. All of my links are down below as well. Please leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!